Hey guys, what's up? It's Kevin here, and today this is a tutorial video. It's my first tutorial video. I'm going to start some um, tutorials now because a lot of people have been asking me how to do stuff, so I, f I find this the easiest way to show a lot of people how to do things. So today, the first tutorial is going to be how to make cool text, like um, like 2D text on um, breaking text and um, like cartoony text and stuff. So I have a 1280 by 720 um, pixels uh, canvas here on Photoshop, and um, I'm just going to delete the background and um, make a new layer, so layer 1. And you can just get any text you want, um, font you want, and um, usually um, you want to find a cool looking text that will look um, good with um, what style you're going with. So if you go to um, if you go to dafont.com, I'll link that in the description for you guys. Um, there's tons of fonts there for you guys to use and stuff. So yeah, um, check that website out. It's really nice. Um, so I'm just gonna use a cartoony like text here, and we're just gonna type in uh, Kevin. So we have Kevin. It's sort of a cartoony text. Uh, make that 250. So you can guys can see it. So as you can see, like this text is kind of plain and um, boring. And so let's see. I'm gonna add a white background to that. All right. So what you can just do is double click the text layer, and then you have all these options on how to make it look nice. And um, you know you can add a gradient, stroke with dif a different color. Um, let's say red like that. Um, or um, so if you want a cartoony text, so you can change this to a um, different color. Let's just do green. So we have a green text right here. Um, so what we're going to do is uh, add a drop shadow. And then we're going to make the op opacity at 100. Distance around 10 pixels. And then... Um, you can just adjust these settings on however they um, look nice. So, like that. It kind it looks nice and cartoony. Um, sort of like the 3D style. As you can see right here. Let's zoom in a little. It's pretty nice. Um, if you're going for like sort of a metallic text. Um, you can just use white um, color text and um, pick a pick any text you want. Type that in. So it's like just white um, like that, and then you just do a stroke. Put that at like around one. Put like a drop shadow on it. You can adjust the drop shadow and stuff like that on however you want, and then. Um, the scale you just need to lower it to however it might look good and um, sort of has a metallic -y t text to it like that it's a nice gradient looks pretty good um, what you can also do is it, um, there's a lot of texts where um, kind of has that shadow on the bottom um, let me show you guys how to do that. Just get rid of all this. Um, you can keep how that looks. Um, let's just get rid of this and change it to a black text. Okay, so you have that. And all you need to do is um, a little trick to copy anything, a picture or any text or anything. Just hold Alt, click and drag out, and then release. It's a. Uh, it's pretty nice. Um, so then right here, all you need to do is rotate, and rotate, um, rotate 180 degrees, and then flip horizontal. So, has this look right here, and you, you can use the arrow keys to adjust, um, adjust the size, I mean like the distance and stuff. Just click, rasterize it, and then just erase sort of the bottom part, like slightly, 
and it gives you this sort of look and then you can lower the opacity a little to maybe around 50 and um, so you have this kind of text so it has kind of the bottom um, shadow glare sort of thing so yeah, uh, if you guys have any questions, just leave it in the comments. And if you guys have anything else you want me to um, do a tutorial on, go ahead and um, tell me in the comments. You know, I'll, I'll for sure do more tutorials for you guys. And um, yeah, so thank you for watching. Please comment, rate, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later in future videos. Peace.